Ask a handful of people what's the best barbecue in Kansas City, you'll get a handful of answers. Gates is the best. Zeke's Barbecue, I really like Slaps. Jack Stack Barbecue, Joe's Kansas City. You're gonna have to go with Arthur Bryant's. I deal with a lot of tough issues. I am not going to decide who makes the best barbecue in Kansas City. From the lines out of Joe's Kansas City to the smell of smoked meat wafting from stadium parking lots, barbecue has become KC's calling card. Any local pitmaster will tell you, slow and low is the key to our style. Our meats are slow smoked at a low temperature and covered in a thick, sweet sauce. And we don't discriminate. Pork, beef, chicken, turkey, mutton, even fish can be found at KC Barbecue Joints. Ah, uh, but it's those melt-in-your-mouth burn-ins. That's become the city's trademark. Pitmasters smoke a brisket for up to seven hours, then cut off the juicy, flavorful point for more smoking. The result is pure bliss. Our barbecue heritage goes back to the city's jazz heyday and the father of KC Barbecue, Henry Perry. All night jam sessions were fueled by 25 cent servings of Perry's smoked meats, slathered in peppery sauce and wrapped in newsprint. Everything from pork and beef to possum and raccoons kept the jazz legends jamming through sunrise. Perry's pupils carried on his legacy long after he was gone, eventually founding current day staples like Arthur Bryant's and Gates. Today, KC Barbecue has blown up in a big way, from down-home dives like Woodyard and Slaps, to fancier fare like Jack Stack and Q39. You could eat at a different KC Barbecue joint every day for three and a half months and never go to the same place twice. Not to mention huge competitions like the Great Lenexa Barbecue Battle and the American Royals World Series of Barbecue. So follow your nose, seek out the smoke, Cause in KC, you're never far from the world's best barbecue.